and welcome to Safe Secure Surfing's DNS Leak Test for IP Vanish. In this video, we're going to be testing how well IP Vanish protects you from DNS leaks using dnsleaktest.com, dnsleak.com, and dns-leak.com. So here we are using dnsleaktest.com. On this site, they offer us two tests that we can use, a standard test and an extended test. So we'll do both of them just to show you what uh, what they offer. And the standard test just basically does one query, whereas the extended test does six queries to check out how many different servers are showing that your location is being broadcast from. So we'll start off with the standard test. And it's showing four servers right now with one query round. We'll go back and then we'll do an extended test. So it runs through and does six different tests and this one's showing three or four. So now I'll go and turn the turn IP Vanish's VPN service on and we'll see how well it protects us from the servers being broadcast. So we're back. I've logged into the VPN service and I've selected the United Kingdom, Glasgow and the United Kingdom as our test location for this test. So we'll see what it does see how many servers are broadcasting using the dnsleaktest.com. So we'll go over to the standard test first. And it's broadcasting just one. And we'll go back and we'll do the extended test and see what we get for those results as well. Alright, so we finished up our test and it's uh, done all six uh, rounds and it's showing just one server being found. So that's excellent. So we'll now move on to dnsleak.com and we'll do the same test over there. Okay, so we've moved over to dnsleak.com to continue on with our test of IP Vanish's services to see how well they protect you from DNS leaks. So we'll start this one and we'll, we'll see how we do with this one and then I'll go back and I'll turn on the VPN service and we'll come back and see how it performs after the test. Okay, so this one is showing that we have two DNS leaks, which is what we expected uh, as it's we haven't turned on the VPN service yet. So I'll go and turn on the VPN service right now and I'll be back with you shortly. Okay, so here we are with IP Vanish's VPN service engaged. We'll start our test and see what we get for results. So this one's saying that the DNS might be leaking but I'm only seeing indication of one server. So I can't say that I believe that it's actually leaking based on what we saw in our previous one with the dnsleaktest.com. So I'm going to treat this as there's only one server and it's not actually leaking. All right, so here we are at dns-leak.com. And the test is running as we speak. So we can review right now. And we've actually got four different servers showing present for this one. Once again I've disengaged IP Vanish's VPN service and uh, I'll go over and I'll restart it now and then we'll rerun the test and see what we get. Alright, so I've engaged IP Vanish's uh, VPN service once again showing that we're broadcasting from Glasgow in the UK and while it's analyzing our connection here we'll just wait and see what we get for results on this. And it's showing that we've got one server, so this one's uh, dns-leak.com is showing that we're not having a leak at all. So that's looking good. So I'm just going to go and do a summary, and uh, we'll be back shortly once the summary is completed. So in this video, we were testing to see how well IP Vanish's VPN service protected you from DNS leaks. We used three sites, dnsleaktest.com, dnsleak.com, and dns-leak.com. So I've summed, the char I've summed the results up here in a chart. Um, so we have before IP Vanish was launched and after IP Vanish was launched. And as you can see, we had a DNS leak uh, as was expected um, in each of the three websites before the service was launched. And we had between two to four servers detected for each uh, website. After IP Vanish VPN service was launched, we didn't have a DNS leak on either of the three sites according to the number of servers that showed up on the websites. 
although with uh, dnsleak.com they did say that we had one but I only saw one server in the results so with that one I put an asterisk beside the one just to indicate that they said we had a leak but I didn't see a leak when we had done the testing so thanks for visiting with us today feel free to leave any questions or comments in the section below and we'll get back to you shortly have a great day thank you